Hello everybody and welcome. Now I am here today with the lovely Tracy. Now you may recognise Tracy's face as a relatively new designer in some of the magazines, but Tracy is here with us today at Practical Publishing. So this is the home of Craft World and of Craft Stash because you are a VIP after winning um, the Card Maker of the Year 2022. Absolutely. So yeah, amazing. You, I was going to say, yeah. how do you feel? Oh, unbelievable, unbelievable. It's, it's absolutely amazing. Fabulous. Yeah. So, um, well, first of all, we've got your cards here. We're going to go through those in a moment and see what an entry, a winning entry, really looks like. Um, and do you know what? They're all winning entries. The, the, the entries that came in competition every year is so so tough. So uh, it's fabulous. Mm -hmm. But you were picked. Now, first of all, have you enjoyed your day? Oh, most importantly, yeah, it's been great. It's been, it's been really lovely to find out all about how the process mm -hmm. works and how the magazine goes together, all the hard work that goes in yeah. and how and what happens to anything that gets sent in for yeah. for the magazines. It's Absolutely. been really informative. I've really so, enjoyed it. Part of the day we've um, obviously we sat had a long chat this morning. Mm -hmm. Um so Tracy and the other winners have been around the office meeting ed magazine editors, mm -hmm. meeting everyone else that's involved in magazine production but also uh, elements of craft stash the team at craft stash as well there's lots of other things that go mm. on in the building we've been for a photo shoot we're now in the <laughs> studio you know it's been a really busy day um but from from this you also had another element to your prize uh, and that was sent to you at home can you tell us a little bit about that yeah every week there was a gift or prize from a different company. There was that many things that I just didn't realise, you know, I mean, to be honest, I only entered because it was something, you know, I thought, well, why not, why not? But then when I won and all this stuff was coming through, I couldn't believe it. Yeah, it was brilliant. amazing, yeah. And have you had time to make anything yet? I have, I, I, I do craft an awful lot. Um, and there is only, actually out of all the prizes, only two items that I'm just getting around to using now. And will you use them? Oh, I, absolutely. Yeah, yeah fabulous. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Amazing. So, yeah, gone to a good home, definitely by the sounds of it. Now, speaking of projects, should we have a quick look at what you submitted and, and just tell us maybe a bit about why you chose to do what you did with each mm -hmm. one? Um, so where would you like to start? Which is your favourite? My favourite, my favourite styly is girly and pretty okay and, this one yeah i love i love anything pretty floral any of those things yeah exactly a very to me it's sort of vintage shabby, yeah, shabby chic. chic yeah mm -hmm. absolutely beautiful yeah oh, oh the box is going there it's just knocked over <laughs> by the beauty of this card um so we'll come to the box in a moment actually it's a bit of a similar style actually so yeah. i'm kind of getting a feel lots of layers here yeah. lots of detail um but not overcrowding on a card which is something that's quite a balance to get isn't it yeah the, uh, the composition is always important to me if it doesn't feel right then mm -hmm. it doesn't belong on the card i don't know so this is so do you do a lot of mixed media yes you I do. do yeah so see i noticed now i've just been talking to lorraine who was also one of the winners she's got a very very clean and simple mm -hmm. style obviously tracy you've got very much a mixed media style um we'll be talking to monica as well we've got all we've got all sorts going mm -hmm. on here so if you're thinking about entering we'll get some words for you in a moment about that actually but if you are thinking about entering don't worry about what style you are because everything's accepted and you never know who might win. Uh, this is beautiful. So this is your 3D item. So yep. you were asked for two cards. Two and cards and a 3D item. And a 3D yeah. item. And this is this is absolutely good. It's so beautiful. It's, it's almost like I don't want to scratch it, but as you just saw it fell over, it's absolutely fine. So <laughs> it'll be okay. And the last card on the end, do you just want to tell us a little bit about that as well? Yeah, this one's just slightly darker and more mixed media style, I feel. Mm -hmm. Sort of more grunge, but still pretty at the same time. Mm -hmm. And it's using my favourite uh stamps which is again floral but done in it could be for a masculine card i think because it's got the double the squares behind yeah absolutely but, yeah beautiful um and again very unique very different did you have a hard job deciding what you were going to do to enter no i i just did to be honest i just did what i like I, yeah i just you know, this is what I really, much. really like to do. So I just did what I did. And as I was, I was actually just saying with Lorraine, if you put your passion into your cards that you're entering, that is going to show through when it comes to judging. Now, lastly, for anyone thinking about entering, do you have any words of wisdom for those people at home thinking, oh, I'd love to have a go. I don't know, maybe you've got questions or anxieties about it. Mm -hmm. What's your advice? Don't hesitate. Just put, put your three things down, what you want to do, work on them, do them, send them in. You never know, and if you don't enter it, you'll never know. And you know what, the, the three winners that we've got here today with us, 
Uh, Anne Marie, I believe, was the fourth winner, so she can't be with us today, but I'm sure all four of you will say that when you put them in the post, you didn't actually believe for a second you would win. Oh, absolutely not. And, and honestly, I've forgotten that I put them in because okay. I just I did it on a whim. So. Absolutely. So there we go. So definitely, if you'd like to get your entries in, uh, I believe entries are open now, so until April 25th. So thank you so much for joining us today. It's been an absolute pleasure to meet you, and I'm sure I'll see your lovely face in the magazine tomorrow. Thank you. Now. Okay, take care, everybody.